Happy Friday, Capital Region. This is Dayton Maxwell, farm business management educator with the Capital Area Agriculture and Horticulture Program, coming at you for the 23rd or 24th Friday in a row. My personal goal is to make it 52 Fridays straight. We'll see if I can do that. All right, this week, oh, before I get started, you'll notice on the board is my self-portrait again. Um, bald head, big nose, big smile, I'll show you. All right, this week I had a chance. One of the things I worked on is I sat with a farmer and we figured out how to value standing corn. This farmer called me and said, hey, what's the corn in the field worth? I wanna sell it out of the field. I don't wanna harvest it. I'm not gonna store it. I'm not gonna do anything. Somebody's gonna come in with their equipment, harvest it and take it to their farm. And all I have to do is nothing because they're gonna just harvest it. I've done all my work. So what is that worth? Uh, we looked at it on a per acre basis. We looked at it on a per ton basis. We looked at it, at it on a per point of dry matter basis. We looked at it relative to a value of, to the value of a bushel of grain corn. Bunch of different ways. What we figured out is that out of all these ways, buyer and seller need to agree that the way they are doing business, both understand and both can can handle that situation. So keep it simple. Big thing is how do you measure the quantity of product that's leaving the field? Do you measure every load? Do you weigh one truck and use that as an example for the day or for the week, etc.? Do you use a self-propelled forage harvester which measures dry matter in tons, etc., cetera, etc.? Cetera? Um, the big thing is keep it simple. And trust is very important. Trust is the intangible currency that makes the world operate. The intangible currency that we all take for granted sometimes, right? Okay, so trust has to be in the business relationship. Just a reminder, it seems like it's been a dry year. It seems like it might be a seller's market. To all you sellers out there, uh, be careful asking too high of prices because as a very successful farmer from Saratoga County told me one time, I'd rather get a little less for my crop and have cash in hand and have my crop sitting in storage and all my money tied up there. All right, that's the message for this week. Farm business management education is where it's at. It rocks. Give me a call. 518-380-1498. Email is dtm4 at cornell.edu. Have a great weekend. My pleasure to serve you.